Good morning! Happy Tuesday, everyone! Thank you for joining me for Rise and Shine! So, I was on a training with my business coach, Shanda, yesterday, and this is literally something that she mentioned all the time. And, you know, I personally, I don't know too much. I don't study the economy or any things, anything like that, but I do listen to people who have results that I don't have yet, right? So my my coach, my business coach, Shanda, she runs a eight-figure company and she has networks with people who are literally at the top, right? <laughs> you guys can hear the roosters outside. There's one out there. Um, but basically, I do take advice from people who have the results that I don't have or I want to create in my life. And I don't listen to people who don't have the results that you know that that's only common sense but basically why i'm sharing this is that my my coach shanda has been saying this for the longest time she said that in today's economy there are actually big companies out there like google facebook or any of those big companies have actually or even donald trump he he wrote like a something about I mean, I'm not going to quote Donald Trump right now, but basically big companies are actually not hiring uh, people with college degrees anymore. They're actually turning away college graduates, people with degrees. And the reason behind that, it's because it doesn't matter. Like if you have a college degree, speaking from my own experience, right? I study psychology and I literally got all A's in, in my college classes. I knew, like, I understood the concept, but absolutely nothing stuck. Like, <laughs> it literally, I memorized the, the concepts, I passed the exams, and then it's gone, right? What really truly sticks with us is life experiences, wisdom that we gain from our life experiences. Like, if we actually been down a path and we did, you know, we took action, we have experiences uh, going from point A to point B, that's what's truly matter, like actual skill set. And that's really missing in a lot of like, you know, people who graduated from college degrees. And I'm not saying college degrees are not valuable. Like they definitely teach us a lot of things like discipline, time management, all of those things. But when it comes to like actual skill set or what employers or uh, businesses are looking for, it's no longer just that piece of degree, like that piece of diploma or the credential. It doesn't matter what you have on your resume, what looks good on paper, but it's actually about how you can deliver. <laughs> like, can you actually do what you know, right? Life experiences, actual tangible skill set. And that's really missing like in a lot of, uh, people with degrees and credentials like just because you did well on paper and pass the exams like it doesn't actually translate across to m delivering the results um and personally for me all of my biggest uh, knowledge and wisdom that i have gained regards to psychology regards to how human behaviors work the human brain works it all comes back down from my own personal experiences it's literally nothing from what i study at uc berkeley like yeah i remember neurons like neural neural uh, neurology all of that stuff but it's like basic stuff that i you know, like it doesn't really translate to how I can create results for other people or for myself. Uh, and what people now in the economy is looking for is actually, can you deliver the results? Like, I don't care if you went to like, you know, Harvard or, or the top university and got a diploma, if you can actually deliver the results. Um, and it's just insane to me. Like so many people are paying so much money to get the 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 PhDs, the masters, but it doesn't really mean anything. Like, <laughs> and 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 that's just the reality. Companies are actually turning away college graduates. Like that's that's happening. Um, they're looking for people with actual skill set. So really think about this. Like you know, in your life right now, what are your priorities? Like, are you still going down? And I'm not telling you to just like turn away from. Uh, if you're pursuing a graduate degree or a master's degree or, or even undergrad, like I'm not saying that, but really think about why you are going in, going down that path for. And you're investing a lot of money, a lot of energy and time to follow that path. 
Are you just doing it because you think that great jobs, great money is on the other side of that? I would have to tell you, like, maybe we think about that because that may not be the reality. Like, if you're really hoping on, on that, what's on the other side, no. <laughs> um, the possibility, I mean, I'm, I'm sure the possibility is there, but how likely is that, right? Like, at the end of the day, it's really all about life experiences. Like, can you actually deliver the results? Like, can you actually do what you know logically and, you know, textbook? Like, you can understand a concept, but if you can actually apply it and implement it, it doesn't matter. So really just think about this, like, you know, where is, what is a better way for you to invest your time, energy, and money is it gonna like for me at this at this time i just know that the best way the quickest way to get results or to generate something in my life is just to follow someone who have walked down that path so for my case i follow shanda my my coach who has created a, a eight figure business literally transforming and impacting the lives of millions right like across across the country across the world and being generous like she has what i'm looking to create so i'm going to follow that um and she basically teach how to build a business right and you know instead of going to business school at berkeley which you know, it's super competitive to get into. I'm just going to follow Shanda, <laughs> right? And then the investment is literally like one-tenth of what it would cost if I went to UC Berkeley's business school. So just some perspective, you know, think about it. Like, you know, if you guys want to uh, chat more about this, just let me know in the comments below. I'd be more than happy to talk with you. Uh, but with that being said, you know, have a wonderful day, everyone. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.